Hey everyone, it's Justin Sally Art. Hope you're having a great day. I just wanted to uh, walk you through the process and our mix as we've been doing these swipes. Uh, so if you guys want to try it out, uh, you're able to do it. Let me show you the consistencies of what we're working with right now. All right, so for our pillow, we're using this Colors To Go by Sherwin-Williams. It's tricorn, tricorn Black. It's real thick, so you gotta spin it out. Make sure it's pretty, uh, there's not too much left on your tile. This is the consistency we're mixing each pigment to, only one pigment per tile. That one right there is Tokyo Horizon. And this one's Origami. Again, this is just to show you the consistency we're mixing to. Just so you can see, try to get an idea. This is our CA. This is Australian Floetrol and Amsterdam Titanium White Paint. It's mixed pretty much um, two parts Floetrol to one part paint. And I know a lot of people say, well, we use three parts this. Yeah, this, I don't know, this bottle was a little weird. I think the white generally uses less, um, needs less Floetrol than the other colors anyways. All right, so we put down our tricorn black pillow and spun it so there's still some paint up there but it's even and just barely came off, you can see. And we're gonna just do a simple swipe, I'll show you guys. I'm just gonna pour some color across that side. Make sure it doesn't run too much off, off the back here. I'm just lean it forward a little bit. All right. And I'm just gonna take this card here, just some cardboard that's cut out, and I'll put some titanium white on it. CA. I'm just going to put a thin strip across it. So just a little bit there. Not too much. If you have too much, just rub it across with your finger. Try to make it even. And then all you're going to do is set it on the edge of your tile. Don't push down too hard. Just drag it across to the other side. Right off the other edge. And we'll let that develop for a second and then I'll get back here and show you guys. All right, that's origami. So it looks like a ghost, right? Sick.